a coin is tossed until a head appears or the tail appears four times in succession find the probability of the number of tosses so here we need to find the probability of the number of tosses so number of tosses can be a random variable and the experiment is a coin is tossed until a head appears so here the experiment we can consider the sample space as first when a coin is tossed if you are getting head you can stop and then if suppose if you are getting tail again you will toss a coin if it is head then you will stop and then again if it is the first time tail and second time also tail and then third time is head you can stop and then again tail and again tail and again tail and fourth one is head you can stop and in case here tail four times if you are doing you are getting tail and here it is mentioned or the tail appears four times in succession so if four times in succession you can stop it so we can say that the sample space is containing h th tth tth tttt so from here the random variable random variable x we can consider number of tosses number of tosses so here one toss we can write one toss or two tosses or three tosses or four tosses the maximum so the random variable we can consider 1 2 3 and 4 the possible values of x are 1 comma 2 comma 3 comma 4 now let us see that the probability distribution for each and every value of x the probability at x is equal to 1 the meaning the probability when coin is tossed 1 only one toss that is head so probability of head is 1 by 2 for a coin to be tossed and probability of getting a tail is 1 by 2 so probability of head is only 1 by 2 we can read and then probability at x is equal to 2 means number of tosses 2 times so 2 tosses means first if it is tail the probability of tail is 1 by 2 and the next one if the probability of head is 1 by 2 so 1 by 2 into 1 by 2 is 1 by 4 next probability at x is equal to 3 means number of tosses are 3 so we can write first toss tail that is probability is 1 by 2 the second toss is tail 1 by 2 and third toss is head that is 1 by 2 so it is 1 by 8 and then and then probability at x is equal to 4 means number of tosses 4 so here in this case 4 tosses either the possibility tail 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 head or we can say tail 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 or tails so here or we are using so let us use the addition principle for both so first one 1 by 2 1 by 2 and 1 by 2 and probability of head also 1 by 2 or means you can add then again tail 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 all are 1 by 2 1 by 2 into 1 by 2 into 1 by 2 which gives here 1 by 16 plus 1 by 16 that is 2 upon 16 is 1 by 8 so 1 upon 8 and then we can also confirm that the probability for all the summation of the probabilities which is equal to 1 by 2 plus 1 by 4 plus 1 by 8 plus 1 by 8 the LCM we can consider 8 so here 2 4 times 4 2 times and 1 time and 1 time 8 so it is 6 7 8 8 upon 8 which is equal to 1 it is also verified so that we can consider the probability distribution table as 
we can consider the random variable and probability at x the possible values of x are 1 2 3 4 So the possible values are 1, 2, 3, 4 and the probabilities are 1 by 2 and probability at x is equal to 2 is 1 by 4 at x is equal to 3 is 1 by 8 and x is equal to 4 is 1 by 8. So this is the probability distribution for the given random variable that is number of tosses. Okay.